Hi, my name is Lionel Messi, and I'm here to tell you why I'm the best soccer player, not Ronaldo over here. Now wait a minute. I'm the one who signed a $132 million contract to Real Madrid. You know that I'm better. Okay, okay, okay. We'll settle this by comparing our careers and overall lives as soccer players. Alright, fine. Then we'll know that I'm better. When I was a child, I thought I would never be a soccer player, because of my having a hormonal growth problem. I played on Argentinian teams such as Grandoli and Newell's Old Boys. Then Barcelona FC offered to pay for my health care if I played for them, so I took the offer. However, because of my size, I have excellent balance while running at high speeds. I had to start off with all different clubs and build my way up. First I began my career with Sporting Lisbon, and then eventually Manchester United signed me on their team for six years and my career really took off. I'm now playing for Real Madrid, but my contract will only last until the end of 2011. But your childhood wasn't hard like mine, right? No. When I was only 20, my father died of an alcohol-related liver condition. Although I don't drink now, there was a time when I went to clubs and drank heavily for about a week. I'm sorry to hear that, but... Yeah right. No. I really am. Anyways, after I joined Barcelona at about the age of 13, I played hard with the older teams until I was good enough to begin my debut at only the age of 16. Yeah, and in your first international appearance, you also got sent off within the first 40 seconds because of a red card. I won my first major soccer tournament, the National League with my 11-year-old soccer team. Oh, so now we're talking about achievements, huh? Well, did you know that the great Maradona has named me his natural successor? Or that in the 2009 to 2010 year I was given the World Player of the Year award? Or even that I was the top scorer in the 2006 World Cup with six goals, two of which were in the final? Jeez, calm down. But now that you've brought it up, I was named FIFA Player of the Year and in 2008, I won the Champions League along with Manchester United. I've also won many other awards and leagues, but there's so many I can't remember all of them. You say you're the natural successor of Diego Maradona? Well I was named after Ronald Reagan. Wow, I think you need to not show off, and you could also try not to brag with your social life too. At least I have one. You know that not only have I replaced David Beckham in the field, but I also get all the girls now. But I'm coming down now because of my lovely wife, Irina Shayak, and my son, Cristiano Ronaldo Jr., to take care of. Whatever. I'm just happy with my wife, Antonella Recuso, and my wonderful home in Barcelona. Did I mention that I also have a mansion that is a part home for rising stars such as Nani and Anderson? However, my mansion was robbed once and had 45,000 pounds of jewels stolen. Along with my jewels, I love luxuries such as fast cars, wonderful clothes, and beaches. Now that you're done bragging, I'll remind you now that when your team, Portugal, lost to Greece in the Euro 2004 final, you started crying right in front of all the cameras of the world. Also, you always fall down so you'll get a free kick and sometimes you try to do a fancy trick and lose the ball. So what? I play hard, and I am one of the fastest players with footwork so good, I could trick anyone out. I can also shoot the ball so well, my range is about 30 yards out and I've scored 190 goals out of 397 appearances, along with 80 assists. My style of play is that I'm always creative in my attacking, and can also fly past opponents with incredible footwork. Since I am left-footed and just as good with my right, I am a very deadly striker. As for my stats, I have 169 goals out of 251 appearances, and 69 assists. That's about one goal for one and a half games, and one assist for every three and a half games. For me it's a goal about every two games, and an assist every five games. But overall, I've scored more goals. It doesn't matter. I score more goals per game. So there. You know what? 
This is crazy. Everyone knows that I'm better no matter what you say. That's not true. Since we obviously can't decide who's better between the both of us, how about we let our fans decide? Okay. So, who's better?